23 degrees, 8.52 in the morning, Saturday, here. Defroster is on, heated seat is on, heat is on, it is cold. Um, not as bad as it's been, I suppose, but on the way to the grandparents' house, as usual, happy Saturday. Freaking pricked out today. Again, we got the Mitt Romney sweater on and the Alex Roy scarf, so... Ooh, I don't know Roy's political standpoint, but today could be a pretty conservative day. Well, something's getting dicked here. They got a machine out. They're drilling holes in the road. Just what we need in Ohio. More holy roads. Is that an interesting light bulb? It's like Edison style. It's got the lines of filament in it. We were at Three Palms having dinner. I got my uh, margarita pizza, I think. It's very good. Almost done. How's yours with your oak leaves on it? I, I don't... It's very good, but it's different. Yeah, it's different, all right. You, you, you ordered what, eggplant? It, it, I mean, it really looks like skinny oak leaves to me. I'm having trouble understanding the point of that. I don't think that. I've seen it. It's disgusting. And it's very busy as usual in here. We waited about a half an hour, I'd say, to get a table. Welcome back. Home from dinner. Actually, not home from dinner, but headed home from dinner. It's 8.59 p.m. That was a long but very good dinner. I had uh, the margarita pizza last time I went. I think I talked about it. It was, it was good. It wasn't great. This time it was a lot closer to the great level. It was really good. Really good. Almost great. Super great. Partially great. It was good. So um, it is 21 degrees, and uh, it's now 9 o'clock as the M5 face fully warns me. That, uh, it's 9 o'clock. i got to get home and get stuff done tonight. So today, what did we do today? Um, not a lot. I did a lot of lying around on the couch and answering to emails on the iPad and stuff like that. But uh, tonight, I'm thinking we're going to have another Skype conference, some of a you-know-what, with uh, Bobby and or Colt. Uh, so we can get done. We did a little bit of work with E39 Source yesterday, set some emails up, administrative stuff like that. You guys probably can't even see me. Uh, but we're waiting at the slight downtown of Barlow and Route 91. And we're about to go. Come on, come on. Oh, freaking arrows. I hate that kind. And then there's this long. You know, there's nobody coming. Why hold all of this up here? And then it goes, and then we get two seconds. Uh, wasting so much gas, which I don't have a lot of. My range is 14. I'm on my way to the, the filling station, and we'll feed this thing, because it hasn't been fed since the way home from Detroit last Saturday. Check it out. The range calculator is increasing as it pumps gas if you leave the key in position 1. 178, 182, 186, 189. Freaking rates. Almost 200. 200. Oh my god, we got this chotch riding on his bike. And hey, for some of you guys that mentioned in the E39 source video, regular gas here is 339.9. V power, it's done pumping, so we'll get out and go check. Looks to be 361.9. Right, right there. And uh, there's what she took, almost 17 and a half gallons or so. Wait, oh, so close. How's that? 63.63. Michelin Pilot Sport all season plus tires are supposed to be okay all season. Um, the roads right now are moderately damp. No slush, no snow, very little salt. But 2,000 RPM, sport off, third gear, 30 miles an hour. If I put my foot down a little bit, the traction light starts flashing. I mean, these tires don't have many miles on them. They're in good shape. Is why one? It's just, this thing has too much power. <laughs> it is that time of the night. Time for some hot chocolate. Friggin' rights. It is 1.20 in the morning. Uh, we're, we're getting this done. Dinner was excellent. I think I talked about that on the way home. It was really good. And I'm in a Skype call over here. We're doing some SketchUp. In a Skype call with Speak. Hi. Hi, it's Bobby. It's where Bobby's at. And his video is is this. He's working in SketchUp, um, playing around with the application since he is not 
as experienced as, you know, I'm a, I'm a complete master. There's not one skill I don't have. Well, not quite, but this is what mine looks like now. Friggin' hell, check this out. Look at my garage. Is that not intoxicating? We have a wood ceiling in the garage. That is beautiful, if I may say so myself. I've been working on the rear of the house. I got a couple windows in. I'm gonna put a big patio here, sunroom. It's pretty decent. Got the porch all set. I think the porch turned out really well. I'm happy with this. This is definitely a better design than my previous, my previous home. So uh, I got a, a thing, a text here. I don't I have no idea who that's from. And uh, no, it's not from cold actually. And Bobby's still working, so we'll check in a little bit. <gasps> I gotta go get my chocolate. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta. I gotta, I gotta go get my chocolate. All right, it's gotta be after two o'clock. Yeah, it's quite a bit after two o'clock. At two forty-two. Just wrapped up the phone call with uh, Bobby and Colt. Colt came in after work. We did some more sketch up. We talked some cars. We did that kind of stuff. It was cool. Uh, anyways, it's Saturday, Sunday morning, technically Saturday night. I need to get to bed, or I'm gonna screw my sleeping schedule for the whole week. Um, somewhat productive. Did a bunch of odds and ends today. It's still cold as hell outside. 17. Um, Tuesday in two days ish is supposed to be 55. So we go from the lowest I saw was seven degrees last week to 55 in the matter of seven days. And then we hit like 58 as a high maybe one day, Tuesday-ish, Wednesday. And then we're gonna be back to 27 by Friday. If you could graph our weather from January 1st to February 1st, started off pretty good, then we dove down to seven, it's not even in frame. That's as far as I can hold the camera out. And then we go up to 55 and then we're it's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. But you know, you know what? It's January 27th, right? 20, this is the day for the 26th, but technically the 27th. That's pretty good. We're all the way through January. Friggin' hell. So, you know, we'll get through February and then March can kind of go either way. And then April, we're in for some rain, but at least it will be warmer. So, I'll keep working towards it. And I'll talk to you guys tomorrow, Sunday. Probably a YouTube email day. So, what a vlog that's going to be. Good night.